now dito tayo sa time rates we are in considered as an application in differential calculus okay so example number one water is flowing in a vertical cylindrical tank at the rate of 24 cubic feet per minute if the radius of the tank is 4 feet how fast is the surface raising okay so yan so since uh, cylinder ang pinag-uusapan natin dapat alam natin yung formula ng cylinder volume of a cylinder okay solution so formula natin for volume of cylinder is v is equivalent to pi r square h okay so meron na tayong given na radius which is 4 okay so therefore pag ito sinubstitute natin dito magiging v is equivalent to uh, pi 4 squared h so v is equivalent to pi or okay, ano na natin arrange na natin v is equivalent to 16 pi h okay ayan 4 squared, binalagay ko na siya sa umpisa, 16 pi h. Okay, so now, ede derive natin ito. Okay, derive. So, dv, uh, dv over dt. Okay, so paano naging ganyan? Volume. So, volume natin kasi is 24 cubic feet per minute. Okay, so time. Equals 16 pi so, i-derive din natin to dh over dt. Kasi nasa time rates tayo, so t will be dt. Okay? And h is yung height. Height ng, ano natin, ng cylinder. Okay, yan. So, since meron tayong given value ni dv over dt, which is so 24, of course, i-over lang natin to. So, uh, Ayan. So, magiging ganito siya. Uh, dh over dt is equivalent to dv over dt over 16 pi. Okay? So, this again, same yung maibibigay niya. Perfect. Okay, so example number 2 natin. A ladder 20 feet long leans against a vertical wall. If the top slides downward at a rate of 2 feet per second, find how fast the lower end is moving when it is 16 feet from the wall. Okay, so solution natin. So first, we have to draw. Draw muna natin. So ito yung wall. Okay. Ito yung ground. So let's say itong uh, yan, ito yung wall. Ito yung ground. Diba? Let's say this will be x. x. Ito yung i-n natin. Kasi x-axis. And then, this will be our y. Y-axis. Since yun yung wall. Diba? And of course, yung ladder natin, nakalin siya na ganyan. Okay? And, its length will be 20 feet. Okay? So, by Pythagore, ito yung mapapansin nyo, right triangle siya. Diba? So, by Pythagorean theorem, by Pythagorean Pythagorean theorem by Pythagorean theorem x square plus y square is equivalent to 20 feet 20 feet square diba? So, kung i-derive na natin yan we derive natin yan explicitly or implicitly kasi meron tayong dalawang domain dito, x and y. 
So this will become 2x dx plus 2y dy is equivalent to, so ito constant, 0. And then, both of the terms will be over by dt. Kasi nga, nasa time rates tayo. t, dt. Okay? Yan. So, and both sides, both terms are divisible by 2. So, divide both by 2. So, ito magiging, makakancel na yan. So, x dx over dt plus y dy over dt and of course 0 over t is equivalent to 0 diba? 0 pa rin yan ngayon itong, itong y dy over dt lagay natin sa kabila okay? so x dx over dt is equivalent to negative y dy over dt okay? so when when x is equivalent to 16 feet, okay? Diba natin? Mapansin natin kanina, 16 feet. Find how fast the lower end is moving when it is 16 feet from the wall. Okay? So, ito, 16. 16 feet yan. Okay? Y is equivalent to square root of 20 square minus 16 square. So, now y is equivalent to 12 feet. Okay? So, nakuha na natin na si y ay equivalent siya sa 12 feet. Okay? So, baka magtaka kayo paano natin paano nangyaring ganito kasi nga yung uh, Pythagorean theorem natin. Okay? So, uh, pag is ito, ito, manipulate natin yung formula x square plus y square is equivalent to uh, 20 square, di ba? and meron na tayong value ni x dito given yan sa formula so y squared is equivalent to 20 squared uh, minus minus 16 squared and meron pa to so y is equivalent to square root of 20 squared minus 16. By Pythagorean theorem. Kaya baka magtaka kayo kung paano naging ganyan yun. Okay? So, meron na tayong value ni x, value ni y. Now, therefore, 16 dx over dt. So, mula dito ha, mula dito, is equivalent to negative y. So, negative 12 negative 12 kasi ito oh. dito tayo nag, dito na ako nagbabase ah guys negative 12 and dy over dt is equivalent to dy over dt we have okay so ulitin ko lang ang y natin is 12 diba tapos kinuha ko yung negative and dy over dt is yan yung change in y. Where in change in y natin is c 2 feet per second. And sinabi dito na downward. Okay? So, magdi-negative yun. So, therefore, dy over dt natin ay equivalent sa negative 2. Itong negative 2, ulitin ko, yan sa 2 feet per second na nag-slide pababa. Okay? So, ito, itong uh, ladder, nag-slide pababa siya. Okay, so, nag sabihin na natin, nagpababa, andito na siya, pa ganyan. Still, di ba? Kaya, parang nag-minus 2, negative. So, therefore, dx over dt natin, dx over dt, so, ito, over 16 natin, over 16. So, cancel, cancel. dx over dt is equivalent to uh, negative 12 times 2, negative 2. We have 24 over 16. Equivalent to 24 divided by 16 is equivalent to 1.5. 1.5 
It will be 1.5 feet per second. Okay? Or 5 feet per second. So, yan na yung final answer natin. Answer. 1.5 feet per second. So, that is applications or time rates.